Good evening and welcome to Wednesday Compline. You know what I'm going to say, let's have that moment of quiet to gather our thoughts before we spend time with our Heavenly Father. Calm me, O oh Lord, as you still the storm. Still me, O oh Lord, keep me from harm. Let all the tumult within me cease. Enfold me, Lord, in your peace. Father, bless the work that is done and the work that will be. Father, bless the servant that I am and the servant that I will be. Thou Lord and God of power, shield and sustain me this night. I will lie down this night with God, and God will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with Christ, and Christ will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with the Spirit, and the Spirit will lie down with me. God and Christ and the Spirit be lying down with me. <coughs> Our scripture reading for tonight is from 1 Samuel, <coughs> chapter 24, verse 6. <coughs> Excuse me. I should not do anything against him because he is the Lord's appointed king. David was chosen by God to be Israel's second king. The only problem was that Israel's first king, Saul, was still alive. You may imagine that David got impatient as the years went by and Saul continued to rule. Yet even when he was given the opportunity to kill Saul, he refrained because it was more important to him to honour God than to sit on the throne. Perhaps you're in a similar situation of waiting. You could do something about it, but you are certain that your remedy would not please God. Take David's example and honour God's time tonight. God will certainly bless your patience and self-control. Psalm 130 verse 5 says, With all my heart I am waiting, Lord, for you. I trust your promises. And a short prayer before we go into a time of quiet. Maybe this is the time to bring to God those times that you feel you are waiting for. Maybe to ask for patience. Maybe to feel peace. Dear God, the waiting is so difficult, but I will trust you. I know you are working through this time and doing great things for me. Amen.
Let's say the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. The peace of God be over me to shelter me, under me to uphold me, about me to protect me, behind me to direct me, ever with me to save me. The peace of all peace be mine this night, in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you again for joining me this evening. God bless and good night.